When cities are building a new subway, they often find pieces of history hidden deep under the ground. And then they have to make some difficult decisions. We're going to hear what happened in three different cities. I'm here in Mexico City, where the Pino Suarez subway station has one of the most unusual decorations in the world. In the hallway between lines one and two, there's a pyramid that was built by the Aztec Indians. The pyramid was discovered in 1967 during construction of the station. The city government decided to keep the pyramid as a part of the station, although changing the plan of the station was very expensive. Later, the city built a new subway line and uncovered an entire Aztec neighborhood with thousands of historic objects. Today, some of the objects are displayed in the subway stations of Mexico City. Here in Los Angeles, a new subway line uncovered some very, very old inhabitants of the city. Not people, but animals. When the red line was built in the 1990s, construction workers dug into an area of very old rock. In the rocks, scientists discovered more than 2,000 fossils, the remains of plants and animals that lived millions of years ago. They also found bones and teeth from birds, mice, and even camels. The oldest fossils were 16 million years old. They were all dug up very carefully and photographed and described for scientists. Now, all of that information is available on a website. New York has one of the world's longest subway systems. In 1997, while construction workers were building a new station called South Ferry, they ran into a big surprise. A huge stone wall buried underground. It was almost 50 feet long and very old maybe the oldest stone wall in New York. Construction stopped and archaeologists were called. They found many objects, including pottery, a tobacco pipe, and a coin from 1744. For years, people argued about what to do about the wall. In the end, the city decided to preserve only a part of the wall, and construction of the station started again. It finally opened in 2008.